What up, big time gang? Welcome back to another Tommy Big Time video. This one here is another goodbye and a review of a watch that uh, I haven't worn much. I've had in my collection for a year or two. I really dig the watch, but at the same time, you know me, I'm always moving to get something else. So um, if you're interested, stay tuned after the intro. All right, so I'm not going to make you guys wait to see what it is. Diamonds and meteorite. This thing is super dope. This is a Bolt Zeus Magnum. Um, meteorite dial on both the large dial and the secondary dial. Uh, diamonds around the bezel on the main dial. And we've got 103... 0.9 millimeters around the uh, bezel. And then, uh, like I said, the meteorite. This is a Swiss Ronda Z60 quartz movement on the main dial and a Ronda 751 quartz on the secondary dial. Uh, super hot watch. I really wanted this. I paid way more than I should have probably for this watch. But um, I wanted it. It was on sale. And I couldn't pass it up. So I bought it. It's all high polished. Super dope. But it's time to say goodbye. Because I'm moving on to something else. And um, shout out to Alan Havens. We we uh, worked out a trade agreement. And uh, this watch is shipping tomorrow. So um, hopefully by the time you see this video. I will have my piece that I traded it for. And you guys can uh, um, enjoy that one. Because uh, I'm really looking forward to the one I'm getting. It was something that I wanted um, for a while now. And uh, this one is uh, a custom as well. So it's super cool. But anyways, I uh, hope you guys enjoy the video. I'll flip you over to this side of the table. So we can be all about the watch and not about me. But um, one thing I wanted to mention also before we switch over is the shirt. Big Nugget. That's a McLaren logo, but it says Nugget instead of Claren. Um, Wrench every day. Tavarish sent me uh, some carbon fiber bits from his uh, rebuild on the uh, McLaren he just rebuilt. Which is super dope. I ordered this shirt from the Tavarish channel or from the Wrench Every Day channel, one of the two. But he was doing a fundraiser from a guy that was uh, a YouTuber. That wasn't doing good had uh, the vid, so um, I also I supported a good cause and I got a cool shirt. So if you're wondering what the McNugget shirt is, that's what it is. Tavares is a YouTuber, um, a large YouTuber, automotive YouTuber, and he just rebuilt the McLaren with this color on it. So uh, I thought I'd hop out and buy a shirt, and I love the quality of the shirt, so I'm happy with it. Anyways, now we're going this side of the table. So, this Magnum is beautiful. You see those diamonds on the bezel? So, like I said in the beginning, these are 103.9 millimeter diamonds. All set around the bezel. And then you got that meteorite dial with the striations there. And you've also got the meteorite on the secondary dial there. Black hands and accents on both dials. You got the day of the week over here at the 9, 10 o'clock. That is um, the feature of the Ronda Z60. Black chronograph hand. Date window at the 4 o'clock. And then you've got this uh, like unfinished um, stainless steel. Complemented by the... Uh, Massive amount of high polishing on this watch. Just a super dope combination. Bracelet is fully done in high polish. 
This watch is in mint condition because I, I bought it brand new. I've only worn it a few times. And by a few, I mean three max. You got the Invicta logo at the 12 o'clock on the case side. And of course, you've got the secondary dial at the 6 o'clock case side. Just a good looking overall watch. And uh, I'm happy to pass it on because uh, you know me. I don't keep things for very long. I hit the goal of 15 Magnums. And now it's time to part with them. So I'm still selling Magnums too. So if you're interested in a Magnum, hit me up. This one isn't for sale. This one's going out on a trade at uh, Allen Havens. But I do have others. So if you're interested, PM me. And a lot of people think these are really big watches. These are big if you're not used to Invicta. But if you're used to Invicta, these are 52 millimeter. Same size as Subaco Specialty. Um, same size as a lot of Invictas, like what we would consider a medium size compared to like a Sea Hunter. This isn't a gigantic watch. It is heavy, but I mean, what Invicta isn't heavy? Um, you compare it next to my new one from the homie Kev. This is considered 54 millimeters case. This is considered 52. They look right about the same size, but the Grand S1 is larger, especially in person. So, and this is considered 54 millimeters, which is two millimeters bigger. So you're not going to see a, a really gigantic, gigantic difference, but this one wears well. Um, I have a large wrist, almost eight and a half inches. And, um, the way the taper on the lugs is, it still works for me. Still comfortable. Not like a Venom. A Venom is a very uncomfortable for me. So anyway, my take on this watch is it's a really masculine, um, done well watch. For us guys that collect Invicta, this is, um, one of the ones you have to have in your collection. With the way they chisel out and really square out the uh, um, size of the case here, right below the bezel. And then everything's kind of, you know, round but square. So everything's got a real masculine look to it. And then the bracelet with that beautiful taper. You've got that taper where it starts out at 34 millimeters and tapers all the way down to a 26. But the way it gradually tapers, it looks really, really good on the wrist. And I'll provide wrist shots here at the end of the video. But just a great overall watch. Um, nothing wrong with this one. I actually plan to keep this one. But I started throwing offers out because I really wanted the watch that Alan had. And uh, we made it happen. So this wasn't even one that I was going to sell or trade. It was in my keeper's box. But I figured uh, I got I to gotta, uh, make it even. I'm not going to you know ever try to get over on somebody. And... Uh, this was a way to make it very even, and you'll understand why when you see the other watch. But uh, it all worked out, and I'm shipping tomorrow. So hopefully I'll have that uh, that uh, new piece to me within the week. So anyway, if you enjoyed the video, stay tuned for the photos. And uh, I'll have a, a video of it on my wrist as well. Uh, have a great day. Model number 28413. Meteorite Bolt Zeus Magnum. God bless.